today is Russ Curtis, Professor of Counseling. It's been a while since I've done an introduction to the channel, but I've noticed more people subscribing and liking, and I'm very grateful for that. I also know that if you're here, you're probably on kind of the cutting edge of uh, thinking about ways of healing. Now, I work as a counselor educator, but I think about healing a lot and all the different modalities. And I suspect if you watch my channel at all, you're like, why is this guy publishing on psychopathy and chakras and star seeds and then some basic theories and so forth? I just want to give an explanation for that because it makes sense to me. Um, is I, I, This channel was primarily comprised of the following uh, counseling, counseling skills uh, in particular. How do we actually apply those? And also kind of mindset, things we need to be considering in the helping field. I'd love to see behavioral health move more towards healing and what's going to need to happen in order for that to take place. I also published on psychopathy because I think in order to heal, you have to understand the systems in our environment that are not for our benefit, that are not helping. With all the oppression, the inequality, um, and so forth that happens out there, this affects our mental health. And we need to be aware of what those systems are in order for us to first recognize why they may be affecting us, but also changes that need to be made, advocacy efforts. And the, the big, and I made this purposefully on this pie graph outside the box, outside its pie piece, is that we're really thinking outside the box with positive psychotherapy, which to me is one of the most promising uh, uh, forward movement behavioral health things that's going on in the world today, modalities, I should say. Uh, yeah, we're going to talk about near-death experiences with hundreds of thousands of near-death experiences and people saying almost the same thing. We should start taking this seriously and what this says to us in terms of living here on earth, but also what happens when we transition. Why are we here? I think we can get a lot of answers from that. Energy healing, chakras uh, as well, and also star seeds. Hey, let's think outside the box here. What is our genetic composition? Is there more to us than we think? I personally feel within the next few years, this is going to become even more so. This, this will become increasingly more prominent that we start talking about these things. But just to give you an idea, if it's a pie chart of the videos I'm creating, we're going to do counseling stuff. We're going to talk about psychopathy, particularly related to systems. Uh, and also we're going to talk about positive psych and energy and um, our origins and so forth. So thank you for joining me. Thank you for liking and subscribing. All you cutting edge folks out there uh, wanting to help the world and, and other people heal. So I look forward to hearing from you and we'll talk to you in the next video. Take good care.